You ready? Is the camera rolling? Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna do some um, dressing. Okay. Now, first of all, let me just say this before I forget. Okay. Pendaries sent me some seasoning. Okay. They sent me some uh, chili, ground chili. They sent me some uh, chili peppers. They sent me some parsley, and they sent me some smoked paprika. Let me tell you guys real quick about smoked paprika, okay? I don't use smoked paprika unless it's something I'm going to bake to make it smell like it's barbecued, okay? Regular paprika is the one I want y'all to use when I tell y'all to use it on y'all food, okay? That's it. I put smoked paprika on ribs and shit like that there, okay? Barbecue chicken, anything you want to smell like it's been barbecued, okay? All right. Then the little boy sent me this uh, CD right here. Tell me I haven't played it yet, but I'm going to play it, Okay? I don't know his name, though. I couldn't pronounce it on the envelope. And then Cheryl Sams sent me some goddamn soap. It smells so, so, so good. So I'm going to get back with her on that there, okay? Okay, Tavis, look here. Now, this is some breadcrumbs, okay? Anybody's motherfucking breadcrumbs. It don't even fucking matter, okay? I mean, that's just, they call it the stuffing, right? And we're not going to do it like the box said do it, because that's a lot of bullshit, right? Okay, now that box said something about um, some um, broth, chicken broth or whatever you want. It don't matter what kind of chicken broth you use, okay? I'm going to show you how. Hey, look at this right here. This is some gravy, okay? You see it on there? Okay. Yeah, I'm going to show you. Look, look how much I put in here. Watch. That much right there, okay? Yeah. That much. Look, this here was the leftover season that was in the container. And when I cut it up, and I didn't want to throw it away, because I know I need that water from there, right? So I'm going to put it back in here. I'm going to put it back in here. This is the broth, okay? When they say broth, broth is, mm, let me see, broth, how thick, uh, uh, opposed from, um, from um, gravy to broth. Broth is like 1% broth, and the rest is water. It's like it's real, it's real th it's real thin. Broth is real thin. Okay, so I'm I'm gonna add a little bit more to this here, just so we get it's a good little taste. You don't add a lot to this because if you do, you are gonna make your shit real real thick, and you don't want to make it thick. Okay, look at that. Come on, get in here. Okay, that's all it is. I'm, I I made my own goddamn broth. Okay, now got the breadcrumbs here. I got a few pieces of bread to go with it because I don't think I have enough. Okay, you just gonna break them up right on up in there with that. Okay, now. This it right here, right? Okay. Add you some seasoning. Okay, come on. This is your seasoning. Remember I said, however much seasoning you want to add to it. Okay? You got it? Yep. Okay. We ain't going to lose our time, right? Nope. Okay. All right. Then this here, the broth. Add that to it. If it's not enough, add some more water to it, which I think I'm going to have to. Okay? The water in the yeah, because it, you, all you're doing is just making this shit moist here, okay? Two eggs. Real easy. Two eggs. Got that? You know what? Like this here. I need a little more water with this here because you want to make it moist. But you want to get them eggs all mixed up up in there, okay? All right. Get back off me a little bit. Shit. Hold on. Look. Get the rest of my little seasoning out of here and shit, you know? Put that in there. Look. This is, it's got to look like this here. I'm going to show you the texture of it so you know. Boy, you better be up in here like crazy because if they don't know, and all the time I'm cooking, Tavis, I'm cooking for the ones who don't know how to cook. Or I, I can make different dressing where it take you all fucking day to make it, you know, some more old school. But I'm just trying to show the ones that's real easy how to do it. And the cornbread, that corn box of uh, stove top, yeah, that's what they call it, toast stove top. I said, remember I told them before, use what you want to use from whatever I do. Uh -huh. So all I'm doing is using the bread from that. This is the texture it's supposed to look like, okay? Or it could be a little bit more moist if you don't want a thick-ass cornbread. This is what I want it to look like. Look. See here? Yep. That's what it's supposed to look like. It's supposed to look like that there, okay? Now what you want to do? Now. Let me rinse that off my hand. Well, they whoop you about your hands and shit. Okay. Season salt in there. Season salt. 
black pepper. And the only reason why I said a little bit, okay, is because I got my hamburger meat that I'm going to add to that, okay? Okay. How did you make the hamburger meat? I just fried some hamburger meat because that is, now you can use hamburger meat or you can use chicken. It don't even matter, okay? And you can use as much as you want to use, okay? Because okay. it's your shit, right? Yeah. And to show them, if they copy the recipe from the potato salad, yeah. uh -oh. this is how much you will have. That much. That's how much you'll have. This little container full. That's the potato salad. Mm-hmm. Okay. That's how much you'll have. Now, see this here? When I put the hamburger meat in there, it got a little thicker. Right? Yep. Now what's next? Okay. I'm going to add a little bit more water to it because I still want the same texture I started off with. You know what is so funny? See, old school could cook this shit right on top of the stove. I wouldn't have to put it in the oven, you know? Yeah, but well now you do. Yeah, because uh, it's easier for the people. Live in old school. Yeah, yeah, it's easier for the people. Just that. Just so it looked like some thick ass grits, the texture of thick grits. Got your hamburger meat in. And this also can be used to um, stuff a bell pepper with if you want to. <coughs> Excuse me. But if you. Don't want to use hamburger meat? Cut you up some chick, some turkey. But make sure the turkey is cooked before you put it in here, okay? You can use turkey. You can use anything. You can, you can put sausage in here. If you want to cut up some hot sausage, you can put sausage in here instead of hamburger meat. You know what I'm saying? So that's going like that. Then I'm going to put it in here. See that? Yep. I don't know what size family to feed, but... And yeah, I'm using the same pot. You know why, right? Why? I washed it out and everything. But, but you know why I'm using it? Why? Because I don't want um, to do a lot of work. Mm -hmm. To do a lot of work and have to clean up behind some ungrateful ass motherfuckers. Okay? But I'm not talking about my babies though. Okay? One more thing I need. I don't see it. I don't see it. Let, stay, stay right there. Watch that really good for me. Okay? Where's my, my damn butter dish at? Shit. Stole my damn butter dish. Uh, you know what? I'm fucked up now because I ain't got my butter dish. Okay. This is what we're going to do. You guys, melt about a half a stick of butter. Okay? Melt it. Pour it over this here. Okay? Once you pour it over this here, then just do mix it up in there like that there because I ain't got my butter right now. I done messed up. Okay? Just pour it over there and do it like that there. Do it like that there. Put it in the oven. Okay? Mm -hmm. You're going to put this in the oven. Sure. You're going to put the oven on 350. Three Start. Okay? Leave it in there until the top browns. And you're ready to go. That's it. I'm done with that. 